What is going on, Waste Sanders? It is me, Lone Vault Wanderer, here with a Fallout 4 PC aliasing fix. If you can see the post in front of me on screen right now, you can obviously tell that there is a lot of aliasing issues just circulating that entire post. I don't know how well this is going to come across on the YouTube video, but the edges are blurry, they're pixelated, the aliasing is just god awful. And I was experiencing this in my Fallout 4 PC game for a while and I could not figure out what it was. But eventually I stumbled upon some threads and people with AMD cards and also people with Nvidia cards like myself are facing this issue. And it turns out that the aliasing issue that you're seeing on screen, hopefully you can recognize it, is being caused by the god rays in the game. Even if you set those god rays to off in your settings, there is a workaround for that I'm going to show you. but the aliasing is awful, and especially if, oh my god, there, you go. like, look at look at the character right now. Look at my character. It is god awful aliasing. The the edges are blurry. It is awful. So I want to be showing you the fix, and then we'll jump back into the game and see how much better it is. Alrighty, so I'm at the desktop on my PC, and what you want to do to fix this aliasing issue is click on the Fallout 4 launcher, it's going to launch the menu, and click on options. This allows you to change the settings in the game. Now, when I first launched Fallout 4, it set the game in ultra settings for me. So I'll just click on that, it'll reset everything, because I had some changes. Now, the problem with the aliasing problems, again, are God Rays. But you cannot just turn God Rays to off click OK and expect that problem to resolve itself and I want to show you why. That's not going to do anything. So as you can see on screen right now, the aliasing is still really bad both on the character and on the post there. So I want to show you the proper way to get rid of the god rays and fix this aliasing issue. Alrighty, so back on the desktop, go back into the Fallout 4 launcher, click options. Now what you want to do, it involves disabling god rays but you have to go around it a little bit differently. It is a workaround and hopefully Bethesda fixes it. But what you want to do, click low, all right? Low settings, what that's going to do, that's going to automatically disable God Rays and that's actually going to disable it. But the problem is, is that now your game has completely low settings everywhere else. So what do you want to do to get back your ultra settings is just increase them manually. I know this is tedious, but for some reason, trying to disable God Rays, the other method I showed you, just doesn't work in the game. But for some reason, if you forcibly set the settings to low, for some reason, this God Rays disabling actually works. So don't change that. Leave the God Rays at off, and then get everything else back to, to the highest. I go with Ultra anyways. And then the anti-aliasing, and 16 samples. All right, all back to Ultra. Now I want to play again, and you'll see what I mean. Alrighty, now look at my game. God rays are gone, but holy shit, the aliasing is completely disappeared. Everything actually looks crisp around the edges. Look at this post. None of those problems. I don't know why, just disabling those god rays makes my game look absolutely phenomenal. It just... I don't know why. The god rays made everything blurry, and the aliasing problems were really distinct and really jarring. Hopefully Bethesda releases a patch where the God Rays we can experience them without those issues. But you got it. You got to say the differences are night and day, both on my character, on the post. There are no more aliasing problems. It all is you know nice and clean around the edges. No more pixelation. No more blurriness or whatever it is. So, anyways, Waste Sanders, I hope that solved the problem for some of you guys out there. Um, again, Bethesda's probably going to fix something like this, but we have to sit tight. In the meantime, at least there is a fix. So until next time, this has been the Lone Vault Wanderer. Please take care of yourself, and as always, keep fighting the good fight.